Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. Every country in the world which has an efficient army has a lot of military equipment capable of hitting armor. Specifically, these are anti-tank missile systems that have long been an integral part of any military campaign. Today, we would like to show you a selection of the 10 best anti-tank missile systems in the world. FGM-148 Javelin the Javelin is an American portable anti-tank missile system. It is intended to destroy armored vehicles and low-flying, low-speed targets, helicopters, drones, motor-propelled aircraft when landing. This is the first serial anti-tank missile system of the third generation, accepted into service of the U.S. Army in 1996. The FGM-148 Javelin anti-tank guided missile has a tandem warhead, deployable wings, an IR homing head, and two engines, a launching one and a firing one. The soft launch system, which ignites the main engine after the missile has flown to a safe distance from the shooter, allows the system to be fired from enclosed spaces. One of the main criticisms of the system is its comparatively short range. It's only 8,200 feet, 2,500 meters. The 127mm diameter rocket is capable of defeating armor of up to 750 millimeters thick. Milan Milan is an anti-tank missile system co-developed by France, Germany, and Italy. It was developed in 1962 for the Bundeswehr that required a powerful and sufficiently mobile weapon for tank destruction. The missile system consists of a launcher tube containing a missile and a launcher unit with a sight, an electric unit, a control console, and a power unit. Milan has a command semi-automatic guidance system with commands transmitted from the launcher to the missile via a wired communication line. The range of the Milan missile is between 245 feet 75 meters, and 6,560 feet 2,000 meters. The Milan missile has a length of 755 millimeters and a launch mass of 6.7 kilograms. It consists of three main parts, the head compartment, the hull, and the equipment compartment. The head compartment contains the warhead and a pyrotechnic fuse. Armor penetration is 800 millimeters. Eryx Eryx is a French short-ranged anti-tank missile system developed by Aerospatial. Developed to defeat tanks, engineering and fortification buildings, as well as above-water targets. The Eryx is one of the most compact anti-tank rifle systems in the world, only 27 kilograms when fully loaded. Shooting is possible from a tripod as well as from the shoulder. The principle of soft launch was applied in its design for the first time. The missile is pushed out of the launcher by a special powder charge and only after that the marching motor is activated. It allows it to shoot from a confined space. The missile is controlled by wires and has a double-shaped warhead weighing 3.5 kilograms, capable of hitting up to 900 millimeters of steel armor or 3.5 meters of reinforced concrete. BGM-71 Toe BGM-71 is an American heavy anti-tank missile system developed by Hughes Aircraft Company and accepted for service in the U.S. Army in 1970. Since then, it has been continuously upgraded and modified in order to meet the changing requirements. The missile can be launched from a portable launching system or from the launchers of various vehicles and armored vehicles. The maximum launch range of the missile is 12,300 feet. 3,750 meters. Targeting is provided by a conventional electro-optical sight. The central marker is guided to the target. The launch is made, and then, before the missile hits the target, the operator keeps the marker on the target. The missile's flight speed is subsonic, 
250 to 260 meters per second. The main shaped charge of the 152 millimeter caliber, weight of the warhead, 61 kilograms, provides penetration of steel monolithic armor up to 900 millimeters thick behind dynamic shielding. Spike NLOS Spike, the Israeli multifunction anti-tank missile system series developed by Rafael Company. Autonomously guided missile Spike was developed considering the possibility of its use by various branches of the military for the armament of infantry, installation on combat vehicles, and for use from helicopters. The Spike NLOS is the largest and heaviest missile in the entire series. It has a launch weight of 75 kilograms and is over 1.5 meters long. Such size and weight makes it possible to equip the missile with a solid propellant engine capable of extending its range to 15 miles 25 kilometers. The missiles are shipped in rectangular-shaped launch containers. The containers are installed on the launcher which can be used with different platforms. For example, the Israeli Army is extensively using Spike NLOS missile systems on the basis of American-made HMMWVs. The maximum armor penetration behind dynamic shielding is 1,000 mm. Shershen the Shurshin is a Belarusian-Ukrainian third-generation anti-tank missile system developed to destroy armored vehicles, shielded objects, and low-flying, low-speed targets, helicopters, or drones. The Shurshin implements engineering solutions unique among its competitors. The basic modification of the Shurshin system includes a tripod-mounted multi-purpose combat module, a transport launch container with a missile, a homing device, and a remote control unit that allows fire control up to 330 feet 100 meters, with a wired communication channel and up to 980 feet 300 meters, with a radio channel. The use of missile RK-2 of 130mm caliber or more powerful B-2M of 152mm caliber in the complex makes it possible to hit all modern armored targets regardless of the point of hit. The maximum target range is 3 miles 5 kilometers, on moving targets and 3.7 miles 5.5 kilometers, on fixed targets. Armor penetration is 800 millimeters with a 130 millimeter missile and 1100 millimeters with a 152 millimeter missile. MMP The MMP has a combined sighting system including thermal and TV homing heads, an internal navigation system, as well as fiber optic guidance. Fiber optic connection allows transmitting the image of the launcher and controlling the missile. The flight trajectory can be both strategic and ballistic to hit tanks in the rooftop of the turret. The missile has a total length of less than 1.3 meters and a cylindrical body with a maximum diameter of 140 millimeters, together with a dual launch system to provide safe firing from confined spaces. The cruise speed is 160 meters per second. The maximum flight range is 13,450 feet, 4,100 meters. Armored penetration behind dynamic shielding, according to the developers, is 1,100 millimeters. RK-3 Corsair The RK-3 Corsair is a Ukrainian portable anti-tank missile system developed by the Luke State Kyiv Design Bureau. The Corsair lightweight portable missile system was developed to defeat stationary and moving armor targets and other objects that have combined, separated, or monolithic armor, including those with dynamic protection as well as small targets such as fixed fire positions, lightly armored objects, and helicopters. 
The system is equipped with 107mm missiles in transport and launch containers with tandem-shaped charge and high-explosive fragmentation warheads. The system allows firing from prepared and unprepared positions both during the day and night with use of a thermal imager. The maximum firing range of the system is 8200 feet, 2500 meters. Armor penetration is at least 550 millimeters behind the dynamic protection. Cornet. The Cornet is an anti-tank missile system developed on the basis of the reflex tank guided weapon system, retraining its basic layout solutions. It is intended to defeat tanks and other armored targets, including those equipped with modern means of dynamic protection. The latest versions of Cornet launchers implement the shoot and forget concept by means of target acquisition and tracking system, but the target has to stay within the sight of the launcher until the missile hits. Also, Cornet can overcome modern means of active defense by launching two missiles simultaneously. There is a modification of this complex, PTRK Cornet D, which provides armor penetration up to 1300 mm and a range of shooting up to 6 miles. 10 kilometers. N-Law The N-Law Next Generation Light Anti-Tank Weapon is a Swedish-British portable anti-tank guided missile. The N-Law program was to create a grenade launcher intended for destroying field fortifications and fighting armored vehicles in close combat. With ranges between the range of classic handheld anti-tank grenade launchers up to 300 meters and full-fledged classic anti-tank missile systems. The N-Law was accepted for service by the British Army in 2009 and went into full-scale production. The anti-tank guided missile operates on the shoot-and-forget principle and is used to fight against armored vehicles and field fortifications. The missile's caliber is 150 mm. The maximum effective range is up to 2,620 feet 800 meters. Armor penetration is about 1,000 mm behind the dynamic protection. That's all friends. Thanks for watching. Write in the comments which of these missile systems you like the most. Also, click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new interesting videos.